What's up guys, this is Bobby W6IWN and I just drove up this snowy road to do a POTA and I got broadcast interference and I can't operate. What am I gonna do? I got a solution, let's get right to it. So yeah, this is what I'm working with. If you can hear the interference in there. So if you got this problem at your home TKH or somewhere you operate portable, uh, no fear, the resolution is here. But yeah, I'm unable to operate anywhere, as you can see. Let's throw on the filter and uh, see if there's any difference. Real quick, here's what we're working with. We've got the Zygu G90 SDR, uh, which SDR radios tend to have this problem. I'm up here uh, below Peavine Peak. I thought my, the interference was coming from there, but there's some uh, lower broadcast uh, antennas that you can't really see from here. I'll try to get some shots of those later. I got the infed half wave. I'm in the same exact location. I tested the version one. Here's the version one filter, the KD9DP broadcast interference filter uh, that I built and tested in the same location. Last time there was, it worked, but there was still a little interference. Now I got the version two that he built himself. Uh, let's see how that works. So here's version two of the filter. Uh, it has a lot more rejection. I'll put some more info about that. On uh, this one was uh, pre-built. I did not build this one. All right, it's working. Found two old guys fighting on 40 meters. But as you can uh, see, we can clearly hear. And if you hear gunshots in the background, please ignore them. I'm near a gun range. Back to the demo. Oh, wait. 20 meters, you can hear guys on again. Not the radio station. Okay. What's this? We got FTA over here on 17. Oh, the bands are back. There's no more interference. Not even way down here. This, uh, this new one rejects out 160 meters but um i can live with that all right let me get in the car and warm up it's freezing it's about 30 degrees out here and uh spot myself on poda and uh, see if we can transmit cq cq parks on the air this is whiskey six india whiskey november calling cq cq poda Whiskey Hotel 6 Foxtrot question mark. Foxtrot Zulu Yankee. Foxtrot Zanzibar Yankee. Whiskey Hotel 6 Foxtrot Zulu Yankee. Joe in Spokane where you are 5-7. Thanks for the 57 in Washington. I got you 5-7 here in uh, Reno, Nevada. I appreciate the chase, my friend, and excellent signal and audio. Roger, a lot of contesting going up, uh, going on today, so sometimes you come up against some strong signals. But I got you in the log, 73, and thanks for activating. Thank you, and have a great weekend, my friend. 7-3. Whiskey 6, Delta, Delta, Mike. Whiskey 6, Delta, Delta, Mike. I got you 57-5-7 into Nevada. Roger, roger the 5-7. I have you about a 3-7, 3-7 into Southern California. All right, thank you. Yeah, I got a lot of QRM from the, the contest going on. I appreciate the chase, my friend. 7-3 and have a great weekend. You too. Thank you. Good luck today. Kilo Alpha 7, Papa Tingo Whiskey. Kilo Alpha 7, Papa Tingo Whiskey. Yeah, I got someone that moved next door. I got you 5-8, though. You're coming over. I'm going to have to move, though. Uh, QSL, sir, I talked to you about a 5-5-5 five, five, five out there. A lot of QRM for the contest. But I do copy you out there. Have a great weekend. And thanks for the uh, activation, sir. All right, thank you. Yeah, guys, I'm getting a lot of QRM. I think I'm in a QSY. All right, the problem isn't uh, broadcast interference anymore. Yeah. It's the sweepstakes. It's a and trying to uh, find... A frequency. So, not a great day to try to pota on the sweepstakes, but the filter's definitely working. Uh, the broadcast interference isn't a problem, it's the sweepstakes. It's always something. It's not the best day to do a pota, but I just did not dress uh, warm enough for this. 
I'm having a hard time finding open frequency. But I got a couple contacts. I just wanted to demonstrate this filter and uh, show you how maybe it can benefit you. So check it out. I'll put links below in the description. And then also, yeah, if you want to see the version one and how that one tested out, I'll put a link up there. All right, thanks for watching. This is uh, Whiskey 6, India Whiskey November 7-3. So <laughs> I'm driving down the hill, as you probably just heard on my soda spotter or ham alert. And uh, I see this big infed half wave up. It looks like we're in for a treat. Uh, Derek W7DLZ, I think he's the record holder for uh, this park. Oh, he hasn't even spotted me. He's got his earphones on. He's doing CW. Yeah, but check out... Uh, his rig here. I don't know if you can see the wire. Yeah, he doesn't even know I'm here. I hope I don't uh, give him a heart attack. Oh, he sees me. He sees me. You're on YouTube, Derek. <laughs> yeah, he's the holder. He's got a way better setup than I do. I like his uh, infed. It looks like he's running 100 watts today. Let's take a peek at, at what Derek built. Come on, camera center. All right, yeah, Derek uh, makes a lot of really cool antennas. Well, anyways, there's a little bonus footage. Uh, this is P-Vine. This is where you hear W7DLZ banging away on CW.